Good evening, guys. Today I'm rigging up a Coco rig, and um, I'm rigging up because I lost one today, and I need to fish tomorrow. So, um, what we need is basically a float sinker, three beads. Definitely, I will need to use. Um, two of the swivels okay two swivels here um we also need um what do you call this a treble hook the reason i use treble hook because a single hook i always miss the fish and um if taylor got the bites sometime it chopped off the the main lines over here on the coco rig and we need um plastic um squid skirt i bought the uh, yamasira one a small one and i like the white color now this leader i use the uh, black magic leader the fluorocarbon usually i use 50 i like that one 50 because I'm targeting bonito we don't need the 80 but the problem is I don't have any 50 pound anymore and uh, I have to use 80 pound I didn't get a chance to buy today so this 80 80 pound line I usually set it up for about less than 2.1 meters if it's longer than that it usually tangle up uh, when you uh, take the whole rig on your fishing rod so this is about 2 meter and I should use 50 but this time I use 80 um, it was okay so um, yeah I don't have any problem with that there shouldn't be any big fish but if you're happy to use this to catch bigger fish 80 should be good then the other thing is I use um, the uh, sinker here and as well as a smaller one inside so when I reel it in it will stay under the water rather than flying up to the air and um, I use an, an EVA float the reason I use this rather than the foam I don't like using this foam because when it hit the rock it break into a couple of pieces easily so um all right let me set it up first so i will need these beads over here basically to avoid any um what do you call that one any uh, problems on this end so it won't break the swivels so I just do a tie here it's quite thick so it's really hard to tie this one for the 80 pound I'm just going to use these pliers to tightening up the line. <clears throat> Once done, and I put this bits back, go through this EVA. EVA ones, this EVA won't break if it hits rocks. Then I put the bits. put the sinker I'm gonna put the smaller first I usually use bigger than this slightly I don't know how many pound is this but yeah that's sort of our round ones and the reason you use it bigger it won't sink anyway on this EVA one this model is EVA 2 less 10 so you can cast a bit further up and I use another bits avoid any 
collision between the swivel and the sinker so it won't break the swivel basically so I just do a tie here Yep, pretty tight. Just gonna do one more using these pliers. Yep, I'll pull it here. Okay, that should be right. Oh, yeah. Too long. I don't wanna waste it. Last thing I would do is to burn that small tags with um, lighter so um, it won't tangle up and uh, be tidy and that's it what I just need to do the last thing is to tie that one so I guess that's all I can say about how to create this cocoa rig coconut rig they call it I hate using 80 but this is all I've got for tomorrow morning so yeah thank you for watching guys and um, yeah hopefully this will help you to set up the cocoa thank you